practical terms, it's it might mean a slightly different performance, I would say, is required. I mean, this is a hard judgment call for a, certainly for a young or inexperienced actor to make. But I would say, based on my experience, sometimes uh, in the room, you're looking for something closer to what you'll want on the day, of course. I mean, sometimes people do pitch it up a little bit in the casting session just to kind of make an impression or to show that they can ramp it up. But basically, you're looking for a variation of, of you know, somewhere close to, or at least in the area of what how you see the performance being. But I wonder if actually, when I think about the kind of things that cut through on tape, sometimes the bigger performances are the things that some, something more memorable, something more attention grabbing. I mean, it's not necessarily to my taste. I'm just saying that that actually, if you're if you're if you're sometimes, I mean, again, I don't want to get too bleak <laughs> for oh. actors, but sometimes these tapes might be not by me, but I've heard, you know, I've heard tales of people watching casting on a phone on a train commuting yeah. to work so they've got their headphones in and they're watching an iphone screen yeah so think about that think about how you think about the you know the the type of performance that is likely to to grab someone's attention in that situation it's unlikely to do it's unlikely that it's going to be to do with minute subtleties wow that's really interesting. Yeah. Scary, isn't it? Well, it is, yeah. And um, for, for a number of reasons. A, that sort of you feel as a director, you're less in the driving seat. Um, <coughs> because, of course, when you get to the, actually film it on the day, you will have yourself there saying, you know, bring it down, bring it down a little bit, bring it down a little bit, let's find something juicy in the, in the eyes. and you know, and, but, <laughs> but, you know, in order to get the gig, you had to just give it a bit of elbow grease for the exec who's watching it on a train. Exactly. And, and so therefore, well, just to be clear, it was only ever you that I said, bring it down a bit. And that's because you kept breaking, <laughs> yeah, yeah, you, yeah. you kept breaking into song and it wasn't appropriate when it's a funeral scene. 